Are you filled with feelings of self-doubt? Do you find yourself prone to minimizing massive dilemmas? Or for allowing the smallest problems to get blown completely out of proportion? At the Pierce Institute, our patent-pending Somnusculpt technology provides safe and effective dream therapy while you rest in the comfort of our flagship clinic. Located right next to the secondary overflow parking lot at the University Medical Center. Somnusculpt will make your dreams come true. I didn't know what this game was about when I first started playing, but it soon gave me a portal vibe, so I kept on playing it. But the more I played, the more I could see that it wasn't like Portal at all. Portal was asking me to erase any notion I had about time and space, to look at the world given before me and manipulate it to meet my goal. Superliminal was asking me to look at the world given in front of me in a different perspective and throughout the game it kept reminding me that perception is reality. Superliminal is a simple puzzle game wrapped in a mind trip with an underlying message given to you with each level you pass. A message that I'll dance around but I won't ruin for you because it's worth experiencing the message the way Superliminal intended to. Essentially you're part of this trial experiment and you're given the task to solve a puzzle in a sequence of rooms by shifting your perception, opening up new possibilities to proceed to the next level. Sometimes you have to make a pathway bigger or smaller depending on your needs. Sometimes you have to ignore the pathway given in front of you altogether and peek around a corner that you couldn't see before. The genius of Superliminal is that it can be frustrating at times when you can't figure out a puzzle, but super rewarding when you do. In fact, I quit on this game about halfway through, when I couldn't understand how to get the apple where I needed it. I knew I had to put the apple on this button because there was no other movable object I could see. But there was an obstacle. This fan below was blowing my apples away. I thought, maybe they're too small. So I made big ones thinking that they would gather up in a bunch and eventually an apple would get to a place where it would open up new possibilities. I stood there, looking at the obstacle for a long time. I couldn't see a way around it. It had beaten me and I gave up. I came back to Superliminal by mistake. I thought I had downloaded Superhot, but when I chose to continue, to my surprise, it was this game. I couldn't remember why I stopped playing, so I continued with my journey and got through a couple of rooms and it reminded me why I enjoyed this game in the first place. The sense of growth you feel inside with each level you pass. But that feeling was cut short when I was faced with that dreaded fan. This time, instead of focusing on the fan and how it's keeping me from achieving my goal, I focused on the core message of Superliminal that perception is reality. And sure enough, once I stopped focusing on the obstacle in front of me, the way forward was clear as day. After you see it, you can't unsee it. And it's almost unbelievable that you couldn't see it before. That aha moment shifts your perspective in life. When things got difficult again and I couldn't understand the puzzle in front of me, the underlying message that perception was reality was now reassuring and kept me calm and focused because I knew that the only reason I couldn't see the path forward is not because I'm stupid or incapable of solving this puzzle, but only that I was looking at the world in a way that was keeping me from going forward. I knew that if I shifted my perspective, the world would open up new possibilities that would allow me to see the pathway to go forward. And it did. I was rewarded with a message of encouragement and it gave me hope for the future. In the year 2020, there are many reasons to look at all the overwhelming obstacles in front of us, and it would be easy to give up. In fact, it would be understandable. But Superliminal taught me, reminded me, you can look at the obstacles and let them get the best of you, or you can choose to shift your perspective to overcome those obstacles. It won't be easy, and it might be the hardest thing you try to overcome, but once you get that aha moment, 
the possibilities just open up and you never look at the world the same way again. I give Subliminal a 10 out of 10. I judge it for what it is and not for what it's not. It's a game that asks you to shift your perspective in life, to open up to the possibilities it has to offer. And Superliminal definitely woke me up to that fact, achieving what it was set out to do, giving me a whole new perspective on life and reminding me that there's no time like today to enjoy it.